Today in our 2013 Chevrolet Equinox, we're doing a test fit of the Yakima Holdup Platform Style 2 bike rack. That part number is Y02443. Now we already have our bike secured down. We're first going to show you one of the key features of this rack. We're going to lift up the back of our rack and we're going to pull out on our red pin here. That's going to allow us to tilt our rack away from our vehicle. In this position, you'll see we're going to have just enough room here so we can open up our hatch door. Keep in mind that we have about 9 inches from the center of our handlebars to the outermost edge. So you do want to be aware that if you have handlebars that are a little bit longer, you might be able to get that door open, but you just want to be very careful. But in this position, we can gain full access to get anything in or out that we may need and put our bike rack back into place, we'll simply lift up until that clicks. As for how our bike is secured down, at the back tire we have a ratchet strap. We're going to lift up on the red button and then use the black portion to tighten that down. And then here at the front we have a wheel hook which sits either in front of our brakes or in front of our frame. We just push on the red button there to loosen that, pull straight down to tighten it down. We also have that cable lock at the top that's going to help to prevent theft and tampering of your bikes. Now we do have the option of compacting this into a smaller position, taking our front cradle towards the back. Our back cradle is going to tilt on top of our front cradle. And we'll take our wheel hook and we'll tighten that down. Now we'll take a few measurements. First is going to be overall what we're adding to our vehicle. It's going to be about 28 and a half inches. Ground clearance is going to be about 18 and a half. And our closest point is going to be about 4 inches. Now we do have the option to fold this up against our vehicle for a more compact position. This is going to be great for close quarter situations like parking. Because now we're only adding about nine and a quarter inches to our vehicle. As for our hitch, this is designed to work with two inch hitches only. We have an anti-rattle bolt and lock down here. That lock's going to help to prevent theft and tampering. With that anti-rattle bolt completely tightened down, it's gonna keep a lot of shake and play out of the bike rack as you head down the road. So that's gonna be our completed look, the Yakima Hold Up Platform Style 2 Bike Rack, part number Y02443 on our 2013 Chevrolet Equinox. Here it is on our test course. We'll start by going through the slalom. This is gonna show us the side-to-side -side action, which simulates turning corners or evasive maneuvers. Next, we're at the alternating speed bumps, which we'll see the twisting action. This will simulate hitting a curb or pothole or driving over uneven pavement. Finally, we have the full speed bumps, where we'll see the up and down action, which is just like driving out of a parking lot, garage, or driveway. Click the link below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com.